Hey guys, welcome to a really simple Substance Painter tutorial and this one allows you to use the custom fonts that are imported inside of Painter and write any text you want without specifically sort of doing it in Photoshop and specifying the thing and having to save out an image file. It just lets you write on the fly whatever you want in the font. You can save fonts in Designer and save them out to use in Painter and use the fonts that you want but you have to actually go through a bigger process and I'll have a tutorial on how to do that but today I'm just going to show you how to use those fonts that are already imported from designer to painter and use that in your model so in any version of usually any version of painter which has this I think 2017 and above it has this feature now if you go into your shelf and you look at alphas and you just type in font you've got a bunch of actual standard fonts that have been exported out for you to use and the different types of fonts that have been exported by algorithmic so you can see here there's a, a selection of ones that we might want to use so as an example what I'm going to do is I'm just going to create a fill layer over my assets that I've got here just create a black mask as an example and I'll choose one of these fonts and you can see because they start with font and I will just choose maybe this one here and you can see it here that it just says substance at the minute and that's perfectly fine you can use it as any sort of alpha that would normally you have a text parameter down here and you can change this so if I leave my just my brush up here and we write in anything we want so we can say you know treats or something like that if it was gonna go on our little um, our dog thing and we can see now we've got treats and we can select the type as you know bold we can increase the size if we so wish and you can flip change position depending on what things have been saved out from designer but these are just ones that have been predetermined for us and as you would normally to paint an alpha you can just left click on it and that's it and we can we can have some more text let's say we can say for dogs or something like that but you've got to watch out that sometimes that the actual text size if you create it too big it might go outside of the actual brush size so you have to just be careful and you might want to scale it down slightly and we can just paint that into there as however we want so this really just allows you to use any of those fonts and you can choose a different one and you can see that it'll change the name you can edit the text there it's a little bit finicky when it comes to editing the text sometimes but as a way to if you get a bunch of fonts that you like using consistently across a lot of different assets like a a plain one a thin font a more fancy font then it goes a long way and it can speed up the workflow a hell of a lot so thanks very much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe cheers